his head off it, but then you see right there, Pierre push. You know, it's hard for Le Pierre to time in the shots. And then when Le Pierre sits right there in front, what do you see? The drives are now working. Combination to the head. Look at Le Pierre covering up, and Pedraz is just letting him fly. And there's another cut to play. And you have to treat him. Left hand that scored. Oh, that 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 this is the time. Oh, yeah. Good shot. As Pedraza turns the tables Five. and scores a knockdown. Six. Called it a knockdown, so he corrected himself. Knockdown Five. scored here in the like tenth. Six. By unanimous decision. Jose Sniper. You were tuned in to G5 Jeff TV. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Hit the share button as you come on in. And follow your boy on Instagram and Twitter at Box with G5 Jeff TV. Now, the main event, Jose Pedraza, Mikel, Les Pierre. It, it, it was a beatdown. Like, <laughs> it was a beatdown. Initially, the fight was supposed to go down and it got canceled because uh, Mikel, Les Pierre's manager, uh, had a positive COVID-19 test. So they rescheduled it for, I think it was July 2nd. And the betting odds was it was pretty much, Mikel Lespierre was like a plus 600. Now, when they had it scheduled the first time, he was a plus 550. And I was like, eh, I was like, I might give him a shot. Might put some bear money on it. But man, Pedraza, he, he put them poles. He put them poles on Les Pierre, man. Got two knockdowns in the fight. Uh, basically was a shutout. To be honest with you, Les Pierre looked like a, a punching bag with legs, man. Like, he made Jose Pedraza look real good. Made him look real good. Now, anybody that knows me when I come in the boxing, you know I can't stand when a guy lets their opponent get off five six seven shots and they don't respond with nothing they don't even try to grab a hold they just stand there in a crouch position and just take the shots les pierre was doing that for a lot of the fight he was doing that for a lot of the fight and i haven't seen jose pedraza look that good in his career period i think that fight went down at 140 you know pedraza is probably going to be fighting between 135 and 140 but based off of the way he looked against mikhail les pierre I mean, Jose Pedraza is open for business at 135 and 140. He looked that impressive where he's probably going to get a big fight at 135 or 140. To be perfectly honest with you, Jose Pedraza, Ryan Garcia, that's a good fight. Jose Pedraza, Ryan Garcia is a good fight. Jose Pedraza and Devin Haney, that's a good fight. That's a good fight for both of them guys, and he would give both of them guys work. You know what I'm saying? So the fact that Mikel Lespierre just looked like a dead man walking inside the ring, it's opened up all types of options for Jose Pedraza. But y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section. G5 Jeff TV, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. Please share this video, support your boy. Support good content at all times. I appreciate y'all. Peace.